What's up my vol dwellers, it is Rob again and welcome back to another Fallout 4 discussion video. In today's video we're going to be talking about power armor and I'm going to be trying to analyze and discuss how the armor is going to work, you know, based on the gameplay we've seen which is not a lot. Now before we begin, I would like to point out that this is all speculation of me, I'm just trying to, you know, I'm analyzing the gameplay and I'm trying to come up with solutions and you know, to different questions surrounding power armor. So the first uh, of many, uh, I guess, little subjects that we're going to cover is, uh, how is the, the power armor going to work in the game actually? So, so far of all the gameplay we've seen, it's a scripted scene and it's the scene where you uh, fight off the uh, raiders attacking the Minutemen facility uh, with a person, uh, person Garvey, I think, I think that's his name. Uh, so we see that uh, he says, can you, um, can you help us, um, you know, uh, ba um, defend uh, ourselves from these raiders? And you go, sure, and then he gives you like a, what I'm going to be calling like a little, uh, I guess like a power no uh, nod that you uh, put, uh, inject, I guess, on the back of the power armor, the power suit opens, you get in, and then you go and, you know, you take the minigun from the vertebrate, and then you go, you know, go um, go to town and, and blast them up. Now, again, that's all, that is all the gameplay we've seen, and this, this raises a lot of questions. The main one being, is the power armor gonna be more of a scripted event kind of, kind of deal, because in the previous uh, installments, we've used power armors, Kind of like you know when everyone and it's just, you know it's just another piece of uh, of equipment or armor that we we can just put on and we can walk around it. It seems that power armor is going to be more special and um, you know different than in previous installments. So uh, all the gameplay we've seen is from that battle, and in that battle it seems that it is that it is a scripted event, and we don't know if you actually get to keep the armor or it has a, some sort of cooldown timer that you can only use it for a specific amount of time. Now this brings us to our second point, which is uh, we do see that you can customize the power armor. We do see in the customization uh, in your garage, we see that, that uh, you know um, Todd Howard is going through many of the different types of uh, power armors uh, that is in the game. So that makes us to think, well, we have it in our garage. So that means that we own it. Maybe, maybe we can. Um, we we see that he customizes. He can change every single part of the armor. He can change the arms, the legs, the chest, and the helmet. So we can we can customize our power armor. We can paint it. We can mod it, and all that stuff. But that doesn't really you know help us decide, decide whether it's going to be a scripted event or we're actually going to be using using it whatever it wants. My best guess as to how this is going to work is that maybe we'll be able to call it in. For example, uh, maybe you, we've seen that you can call in a bird of bird by throwing a flare and it'll come and pick you up and you can use the minigun. Maybe that'd be the same way. Maybe you can call in um, a bird of bird and it'll drop it off wherever you're in battle. Now that does seem unlikely because it's in your garage and um, it doesn't really make sense that there's going to be a bird of bird and a member uh, of the Brotherhood of Seal just waiting to you know drop you off your armor whenever you need it. So that does seem unlikely but it seems to be a, a possible you know a solution until how are we going to use the power armor in Fallout 4. Another interesting point that people uh, say is that it looks more like it's going to be a sort of vehicle. Yeah, you know, you know, throwing it back to my other video. Uh, it looks, people are saying like it seems that it's going to be more of a vehicle. It's not just an armor. It's a suit. You wear it and it's powerful and you can get to use it the entire game. And I totally agree with that and that's what I think is going to happen. I agree that you won't be able to use it uh, at all times. I, I that, that makes a lot of sense that you don't get to use it at all times. Uh, during the um, the game, you can just pop it on and you can wear it for the entire time. It does seem like it's more, it's heavier. It can probably protect you more, and it can, of course, do more damage with the minigun or whatever um, you know weapon you can include in the power armor. So I do think that it's not going to be a all-time use, and there's going to be uh, certain events that you can use it. Now again, we don't know if it's going to be scripted events or if it's going to be like you can call it in. You can be like, okay, I think it's a time of word. Let's uh, you know throw a flare, and then my buddy from the um, with a vertebra will drop it in. Or maybe you can only use it when you're, when you're close to it. If you have it in your garage, maybe you have to go to your garage and then grab it. You know, it's, there's a lot of different uh, routes this can go to. But of course, um, you know, that's, that's all I can think of, of different possibilities, the way the, uh, um, the power armor is going to work in this game. But I want to hear what you guys to say. So uh, what do you guys think? Do you guys think it's going to be more uh, of, um, of like a, you can call it in? Or do you think you can actually use it the entire game? You can just use it whenever you want. Do you think it has like a cooldown timer kind of thing? You know, or, or anything else that I might have missed? Or, uh, you know, any other suggestions you guys have? Please leave them in the comment section below because I always talk to you guys. I try to respond to everyone and I love doing that. So, but that's going to be it for this quick discussion video. Uh, again, I'm trying to make, uh, I'm trying to upload daily videos. So, the way uh, it's working, I'm going to be uploading Monday through Friday. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to upload on the weekends because I do want, uh, have time to actually make the videos. 
So, uh, you know, daily, I, I guess, and say, instead of saying daily, I want to say every uh, weekday um, the, of the week, of course, to make videos. So, hopefully, guys, you guys are enjoying this new little thing I'm going for. And hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys did enjoy this video, then be sure to leave a like below and subscribe for more Fallout 4 content. My name is Robert, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy Vault Dwelling.